Hey everyone, this is a Christmas decor video for outdoor DIY projects hosted by Miss V and Measure and Mix. Measure and Mix is at it again, teaming up with Mrs. V this time, and I'm just sharing my front door decor. That's all I decorated this year pretty much for um, the outside. So here I'm putting together an ornament wreath. I got all of these ornaments from the Dollar Tree, and I'm not sure if I where I got the stand from. I'm, it might have come from Walmart or might have also come from the Dollar Tree, but it is something that I already had. So I put together um, every other row of um, the ornaments with the shiny one and then the flatter matte one. And here I am just putting some more of the smaller gold ornaments on top of those first two rows. Just going through, I have already placed them, I'm just gluing them down. And here I'm adding my pop of red. Gold and red are the colors that I'm working with this year with a little bit of white and maybe a little black here and there, but mainly gold and red. So just to give it a little bit of a pop of color, I'm adding the red. And once that's all done, I'm just gonna add this bow. It came from the Dollar Tree in a pack of three. I'm gonna glue that right to that um, extra ornament that was placed in the middle because there wasn't um, a space big enough for the other side, so I covered that with the bow. And here it is on one of the doors. We have two front doors. One is our main door that we use, which is this one. And then we have another door that is the, the official front door, but we don't use that one, and I'm using this decor to go on that door. So I have this Dollar Tree wreath. It's about nine inches in diameter. And I'm gonna make a J and a Y out of this wood that I already had laying around. This is a very easy project that can be done with just the cutouts already made. You can purchase those anywhere. Walmart is probably the easiest place to find these for a lot cheaper than maybe Michael's. And again, I'm just using this because I already had it and um, just showing how I traced out the Y and the J using the ruler. I made the letters about two inches in width and then I made them about nine inches wide and nine inches tall. Just going around with the final measurements here, making any adjustments. And then I'm just sawing that apart. Um, the wood is very thin, very easy to cut through, but as I was cutting it, it did um, leave a little bit of um, jagged edges. So um, I did something to correct that, but I'm just showing how I cut the letters out. And I use this little thing, I'm not sure what it's called, to go around the bottom of the J and round out that bottom part of it. And then I'm using this Rust-Oleum metallic gold to spray paint that wreath. And I'm using this spray adhesive on the J and the Y to cover it with paper because of those jagged edges um, didn't come out quite how I wanted. So I'm covering that here and I cut around the shape of the letter and I'm just gonna paint right over the paper with this red paint. Purchased this at Michael's a while ago. And as you can see, um, because the paint is not dry, it's causing a, a few lumps there, but I didn't mind because it did dry a little flatter than that. And it's also only gonna be on the door, so you're only gonna see this from a distance. And just finishing up with the Y here with this bright red. And once that was done, um, the wreath was dry, so I got these little berries and I glued those around the wreath to add the pop of red and one of the Dollar Tree bows. And then I got this white string, I braided it together to make it a little bit thicker and used that to attach the J and the Y to the wreath. And I measured it to try to keep the same distance between the letters and the wreath. And this is the final result.
And the last thing that I did for the outside was to update the planner box. This box holds our house number and it also holds this floral decor. And I'm just showing here how I put that together in a previous video. If you're interested in seeing that, I have a link here in case you want to check it out. So I just took out the fall flowers and I added these poinsettias that I got from the Dollar Tree. And this is how everything came together. So the front of the house is all set. The two porches and the um, front wall and this is it. So thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.